Protecting our environmental resources and addressing climate change is going to require an all hands on deck approach. Our nonprofits oftentimes have the boots on the ground experience and the scientific research and data that we need as policymakers to make good decisions and smart investments to protect and preserve these resources for everyone. When it rains, that water falls on our roofs and it picks up all of the pollution from the atmospheric deposition. It runs into our yards, into our streets, picking up fast food containers and cigarette butts that have been tossed out of car windows. All of that goes into our storm drain system, into our rivers, and eventually out onto the beach where it washes up. If we were to take a walk along the beach right now, we would find plastic, we would find bottle containers, fast food wrappers, and it's coming from inside the watershed, from throughout the watershed, and we're trying to protect that. Our oceans are an asset for our entire city, our county, and our state. So it's essential that we're investing in the upstream infrastructure that we need to prevent that garbage from hitting our beaches. The amount of pollution is an indicator of our ocean's overall health. And we're seeing things on the shore today that are detrimental to sea life and wildlife. One of the best ways to get inspired is to join your community for a beach or neighborhood cleanup. Heal the Bay hosts beach cleanups every third Saturday of the month. Come join your community, make a huge impact. We pick up hundreds of pounds of trash at every beach cleanup. Be a part of the solution. Here in the 11th district, we're home to some of the most incredible environmental resources in our entire city. From our gorgeous Biona wetlands, to our Santa Monica Bay and our coastline, to our Santa Monica mountains, I take the obligation to be a steward of these assets very seriously. So on Earth Day and every day, I want our community to know that I'm going to fight to do everything I can to protect these resources for future generations.